All right, let's uh, continue with our piece here. Now, <clears throat> let's go ahead and thin his legs up because his legs, of course, are way, way too big. Thin his shoes up. We can actually come up a little bit further with the crouch line. Now we can make this a fat golfer, or maybe I shouldn't say the word fat. That's probably politically incorrect. Um, pleasantly plump golfer, but we <laughs> I know, I used to be 250 pounds one time in my life, and I had to lose a whole lot of weight. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to sharpen my knife again. I'll be right back with you. I like to stop every once in a while and do that. Usually you don't see me doing that, but I, I'm, I'm gonna start doing it more to give a carver's ideas that you can you should stop about every 15, 20 minutes and, and strop your knife and get it sharp again. Now what I'm doing here is I'm just basically thinning up this figure. Thinning it up. <clears throat> Getting rid of the excess wood that I don't, I'm not gonna be using. There we go, he's thinning up. He's still pretty heavy. So we're going to thin him up some more. Sometimes it takes a little bit of wood removal to get this stuff going the way you want it. here and I just sort of because most of the time a, a, a golfer his legs are stuck out pretty far when he's 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 driving or putting or doing whatever In the words he is a stance that golfers have I never did play golf my father was a golfer and I I guess I learned to hate golf because I was a caddy and I'd have to caddy for my dad and I'll tell you what Carrying that old clubs around for 18 holes was something else. <laughs> but he taught me a lot of things. He taught me, you know. So, as we can see now, we are thinning him up quite a bit now. So, we're just going to continue to thin him up, remove the wood. Now we're, we're really starting to see uh, the form or the shape that we want and what we're, we're doing here now. And as you see, the arms continue to get larger and larger. So, uh, sorry. Now what we're going to do is we're going to come out here to the arms. We're just going to draw a little line right here. 
where we're gonna cut here and we're gonna cut that down because what we want it to do the arms to do just sort of make a little slant here and they're there see that we're we're in here you sort of have a Uh, where the arms are sort of bu uh, uh, where the elbow is in other words and the same thing here we want to just kind of make a cut deeper cut in here and the same thing it will this is sort of where the elbow comes and then it it goes down like that, in other words. See? Now, let's continue to bring all right, let's continue to bring the uh, I want to bring this 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 body down even even more. shoes down a little bit more too but we're getting there we're doing need and let's come in between those legs a little bit more See, it's pretty good little space between the legs, in other words, that uh, a golfer stance is that way. And then we slowly begin to bring the legs down. And then we'll start doing some of our our uh, our uh, detail work on it. But you want to get your shape the way you want it, in other words. And of course, the the back is arched. It's got an arching thing to it. All right, now let's look at our piece. Much thinner now, much, much thinner. Now, what we wanna do is I wanna come, come in and, and thin this up even more back here. Because I want the pants, still a little bit too thick for me. I want the pants to um, I'm just going to kind of cut a little bit deeper back here, like that. Get these saw marks off here. Because I want the pants to, to go this way. On, on the shoes, in other words. So, I'm gonna go ahead and cut that. And then, I'm gonna have them fit sort of over the shoes. Just like this. When you get the um, the way you want it, which will mean you will bring the shoes down. 
Now the shoes, as soon as I get them exactly the way I want them, see what I'm doing? Now if we look, the shoe is, shoes are still too big. They're still too big, so let's go ahead and bring these shoes down. Now, a golfer would wear very comfortable shoes always because there's a lot of walking in golf. So, he's going to, you know, wear comfortable shoes. Let's put it that way. And most of them are flat shoes. They're not, uh, they're not, you know, dress shoes or anything like that that a golfer would wear. And this back here needs to come down also. Now, basically most golfers wear uh, comfortable clothing because they're out on, they're going to be doing a lot of walking, they're going to be doing a lot of, so basically what you're going to see is just basically just pants that are very, very comfortable. All right. Now. I'm going to make a cut back here. Okay. Starting to rain a little bit here. And I want to bring this insole even further up here in the back. Crouch area in other words because a, a golfer wears very comfortable sh shoes and pants in other words see from the back back here and um, I hadn't done a golfer in, oh man, I did a golfer many, many years ago out of a pattern from a book. And it's been years since I've done a golfer. Okay. So basically they're very comfortable pants. They're not, uh, So, anyway, all right, what have we got here? Let's bring, this head of course will be brought down even more. So let's go ahead and bring it down some more. We're gonna put a little hat on him. As he's looking down. Now, one of the areas that needs to definitely come down is this area here. You don't want to take the hump shoulder away from him because he is, you know, going down, uh, looking this way. And of course the arms have to come down now. We start beginning to really... All right, now what, what we're gonna do is we're going to start bringing these arms down okay mostly in this this area as we say
and of course these arms have to come down here stick out way too far now see how that and all this has to come down in here because the shoulders don't come back this far well the shoulders do but I'm just saying this all has to be brought down in here just like that and he's not a hunchback so this all has to be brought down okay now we also have to come, come up here and go ahead and start thinning this arm up okay and the same thing here thinning the arm up thinning the back up sort of making the shoulders sort of come up like this in other words there we go see where the shoulders will be coming forward like that and then we need to bring these shoulders down just sort of like this take it and just flip your knife a little bit just like that now what we're going to do is take our pencil and we're going to make our shirt somewhere in here. So I'm just going to go ahead and cut that, like that, and then start bringing this arm down right in here. See that? We're going to cut deeper into here. Okay. And then we're going to bring this down. them off there and we're going to come over here and do the same thing we're going to draw our, our little and we start taking our arms down and actually they kind of come like this just like that so you want to bring it from the inside like that now this has to come deeper into here and then you have to bring that up like that Now let's go ahead and make our arms a little bit even a little bit
I'm sorry. <coughs> oh. Just got a whiff of a little bit outdoors there, a little asthma issues and sorry, excuse me for all right, so as you can see, and we're gonna flip this in here, just like this. And we're gonna flip that in there just like that, in other words. <coughs> I apologize. <coughs> I did not develop asthma until I was almost 65, and that was that's really unusual for a person. Although I've had tuberculosis and other things like that, you know. That. All right. Now we're starting to look like something in here. I'm going to take that, put that like that. Now we're going to just thin this all up in here on the <coughs> oh I'm sorry and we want to thin them arms up in here quite a bit. All right. Now, the reason I didn't thin a whole lot up is because we have to do the hands. And I'm going to come back and, and we'll continue again. And, and we'll work on the hands. And uh, um, so uh, as we see, I'm just getting these shoulders down just a little bit just like that so as you see now um, we're getting there we're getting there as we work on this and um, We're going to bring these pants down, of course. Uh, they're, they're too big. But we'll do that once we get the hands pretty much uh, done. Okay. We'll be back.